hello guys welcome back to my channel it is priscilla a food and a lifestyle blogger here in france so today i'm going to be showing you a five major places we do not clean in our home if you want to clean like a pro these are the five major places you should get your focus on so let's quickly get on it and get started so guys the first place is the baseboard the baseboard so here you're going to take a wet rag and then some cleaning vinegar i'm using this cleaning vinegar then here you're going to spray a little bit on it depending on the type of baseboard you have so the one that i'm having is not a a woody baseboard it is a marble baseboard so you can spray you can spray the uh, vinegar mixture on it then so as you wipe make sure you wipe the edges So guys, the second one is your door handles and the switches. Because sometimes we we open, majority of the time we open and close, open and close the doors without even knowing that we are dating the handles of our doors. And so we don't clean them often because we don't even think to that direction even the switches in our home we on and off we on and off our lights each time and every time so we don't even think of cleaning them so these are the places that we touch every day and every minute every hour that needs to be clean so what you have to do is to get your weight rack get a wet rack then you sprinkle the vinegar on it sprinkle your vinegar on it and then start wiping down the handles the handles of your doors And then the swishes. To soak it a bit on the water then I'm going to wipe off that stain because if you don't take care 
of these little stems one day they are going to grow into a bigger stems that will warrant you to repent your home so with children in your home you need just to be careful So as you can see, that stain is off. So this is a magic sponge. You use it to clean and wipe off small, small stains on your wall. Guys, the third one is your dustbin or your garbage uh, bag. So uh, like, as you can see, I have a stainless dustbin and each time we open and close or whatever there is always a, a handprint or the water of your garbage i mean draining on the pot and what have you so as a stainless dustbin you have to always clean it and make it uh, shiny so i normally clean my dustbin using this uh, product I wipe it down with this product in a wet rag and then I come back with um, uh, I come back with this the the plate um, washing soap so I wipe it down the second time then I go back with a clean water I go back with a, a clean water finally with a clean rag so that is the fourth step i take to wipe down my stainless dustbin so that it looks stainless and flawless at the end of it you are going to find a clean and without without harsh lines on it So guys, here I have my dustbin already broken. I mean, the door, the handle of the dustbin is already broken, but uh, nevertheless, I'm still going to wash it that way. So I'm going to start by washing the inside part of this dustbin, inside of it. I'm going to start spraying my vinegar mixture even on the yeah.
so guys here is the end of the cleaning of my my dustbin or garbage trash so guys the fourth one is your washing machine soap dispenser we don't wash this we hardly wash this one here we hardly wash it so i'm going to remove it and give it a thorough wash and a wipe down in a clean water so we hardly look at this all the small small things we hardly wash it i'm going to remove it so look at that so if you don't wash it look at all this residue soap residue it will remain there sometimes it sticks and never goes away so you need to first of all you use your cleaning vinegar then you add you apply the cleaning vinegar on it just to give it a flush down then you leave it for some time before washing it So the fifth one guys which is the last one as the case may be is the sink water drainer that is what i mean here this area so we don't normally clean here and they are always dirty so i'm going to show you how i clean it so i still have my vinegar spray I'm going to spray it right in there leave it for two minutes and then wipe it down with a brush
So guys, the sixth one as a bonus, mm -hmm. as a bonus, it's not included in this five ways of keeping your home clean. It's a bonus. So, <laughs> it's to clean your plants. For those of you who have house plants, sometimes just take a look at your house plant. You find out that it is dirty. Because it has dust, a lot of dust on it. But sometimes we don't see that. We need to clean it and wipe it down with a wet rag. Then water it, sprinkle water on the leaves. Not only on the roots of the plant, but on the leaves as well. It makes the, the, the plant lively and shiny. So who wouldn't want that? Yes, who wouldn't want that? So that is uh, another way of keeping your home clean. Hmm? Yes, I'm going to leave you here. If you like this video, do not forget to hit on the like button. And then subscribe to my channel if you are still new to my channel. Because I know that there are people who come and watch my vlog or watch my my contents but they are not subscribed so my channel like and share this video if it is of good interest to you i'm going to leave you here today see you on my next vlog thank you for watching bye 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 Au revoir.